The following message is brought to you by New World Organization 2.0. Hello everyone, Hollywood Big Boss here. And for the first time in years I can say this with pride in front of this camera. I am your Duelist Sans Fronteries Duel Monsters World Champion. You see, March 3rd, 2018, I took on two of the deadliest competitors in the Pontiac Duelist League, Savril and the Executioner. And while the Executioner dominated that duel with his new deck, I walked out with the world title. Now some of you may be like, oh, Hollywood, what's your next move? Well, I can tell you what it's not going to be. I'm not just going to sit around in my apartment and cower away from my rightful challengers. No, no, no. I'm upping the fucking ante. Savril is well deserving of his rematch against me. However, as many people know, this causes a scheduling conflict because Red Mist was supposed to come to the Pontiac Duelist League territory representing only Heritage Duelist League and challenged the Duel of Sans Fronteries world champion. So instead, here's what my challenge is going to be. Savril, Red Mist, March 24th, 2018. A triple threat match for the Duel of Sans Fronteries world championship. As many people know, when I won this title, I was not on the offensive end of that duel. The Executioner built up his forces and built him up and built him up, and I won with Exodia. I came in the back door, and there's no shame in admitting that. I was the better duelist than Savril and the Executioner were that day. But I'm only good as my next duel, as good as my next opponent, and it's only fitting that I give the rightful opportunity to the two toughest duelists in the Pontiac Duelist League and Only Heritage Duelist League. Because if either one of them can beat me, then I don't deserve to have this. I only deserve to have this championship if I'm the greatest duelist in all of Duelist Sans Fronteries. And the only way that I'm going to prove that I'm deserving of this championship is if I take both of them on at once and defeat them at the same time. I'm not going to run from my challengers like some people have in the past. I'm taking them head on with pride. And even if I lose, I know that I put forward my best effort that I was capable of putting forward. Red Mist, Savril, it's gut check time. I'm more focused and ready than I've been in years, and the old Hollywood big boss is back. I don't need NW 2.0 to back me up in a title defense. I can handle it all by myself. So, I'm going to end this with a statement to Red Mist. Red Mist, I've known you since September of 2015. Since that entire time, I've never once defeated you in a duel. Three years you have defeated me time and time and time again. I lost count after almost 20 duels that we've had. I've tried everything. I've hit you with everything but the kitchen sink. And you've come out on top every fucking time. I am hungrier than ever. And the only way that I'm going to prove that I deserve to have this. Is if I can beat you. And if I can beat Savile. So guys, bring your A-game. Because I sure as shit am. The preceding message was brought to you by New World Organization 2.0.